What's poppin' everybody? So I just heard something crazy. My guy Jalen Q is going straight to the league. You heard that right. That means no college, no overseas, no G League. The NBA, like, now. For those of you who don't know about Jalen, I'm about to fill you in. He's a 6'4", 190 pound combo guard from New York City. But he's been hooping out in New Hampshire at Brewster Academy for the past year or so. Jalen got that jelly, he's got that jam, and he's got so many other tricks in his bag. If you watch him play, it becomes very clear why Big Bro gets all the Russell Westbrook comparisons. It just so happens that that's Brody's favorite player too. I've had my eye on Jalen for a while. He's one of the first guests I've ever had on the Overtime Challenge. This is 60 seconds of jam. And yet, everybody's jaw dropping with his performance in 60 seconds of jam. <laughs> Different, I know. After his workout, where he did his best Hoodie Mellow impersonation, Jalen sat down and gave us his secrets to the bounce. Check it out. Secret to the bounce, Vertimax. Vertimax? I used the. I just started to use the Vertimax. I before I had bounce, but now I just have way more like bounce. Floating now. now. Yeah. So the Vertimax, huh? That's what I gotta go get. On the real though, there's a lot more to Jalen's game than the bounce. I've seen him grow from an underclassman playing in NYC to a growing prospect matching up against Zion Williamson at the Christ School. Yeah, I went to that game last year, and it was crazy. And now he's a walking bucket for Brewster. My personal opinion is aside from the attention he gets from being so bouncy. Jalen's underappreciated as a player. Despite his all-around game and pure athleticism, he's only considered a four-star prospect and a top 30 player in his class. I was pretty happy when I got the word that he was attending NT State. I felt like it would have been a perfect opportunity for him to show off his diverse skill set and get buckets at the next level. But now I'm getting word that he might not go to college at all. How is that even possible if he's still in high school? Well, here's the thing. Jalen is actually a fifth year senior and he's doing what a lot of people know as a prep year. Because Jalen will be 19 years old before the NBA draft in June, he's technically eligible to enter his name. Does this sound familiar? That's cause Jalen's not the first to do it. Several players have gone this route before, but you probably are most familiar with my IMG brother, Anthony Simons, who did this last year. I can go in and you know, hold my own against you know, good players. I know they're good, but honestly, I feel like I can hold my own. It goes without saying, Jalen has NBA athleticism right now. But he's definitely got some development to do as a player. His shot's still a little inconsistent. And this question whether he's a true point guard or a better fit at the two spot. Like I said, I stand by my word when I say he's an NBA level point guard and could very well be the next Russell Westbrook, just like he hopes. A lot of NBA scouts and coaches seem to have the same excitement when talking about LeCue. But I want to know what you guys think. Should Jalen stick with the college route or should he go straight to the league? Or should he develop a couple of years at the G League? Let me know what y'all think in the comments below. I'm off this. That boy good, he learned from Larry. Ha, <laughs> you wanna see more videos like that? Check him right here. And also, click subscribe, why you haven't done that? You know the way, OT way.